Welcome back to the channel, guys. It's been a minute and a half. My name is Peter Kostecki. I'm a real estate broker here in Kitchener-Waterloo. And every week I put out content for buyers and sellers, our fabulous listings, and my hot takes. So make sure you smash that subscribe button and don't forget to click the bell so you don't miss another video. Now, let's dive into it. I've got last month's real estate market report right here, courtesy of Quar. So grab your popcorn, kick up your feet, and let's dive into it. All right, let's look at the big picture. On the Kitchener-Waterloo Association of Realtors MLS, there were a total of 854 residential properties sold in May. This represents a 0.9% increase over April, so things are looking pretty steady. Nothing's been typical about the spring market this year, so let's dive into the details and figure out what's going on. Okay, so beginning with detached homes, there are 485 sold last month, which is basically the same as April because we had 484. So volume's pretty steady. Now with condos, there were 106 sold in May, which is down a little bit from 111 in April. There were 74 semi-detached homes sold, which is up a bit from April where we had 67. Now for townhomes, there were 188 sold in May, which is up a little bit from April, which there are 181. Now let's look at prices. In May, the average sale price for all residential properties in the Kitchener-Waterloo area was $740,103. This represents a 2.4% decrease compared to April, where we saw an average sale price of $757,906. Okay, rapid fire. So the average price for a detached home was $868,990. This represents a 3.4% decrease compared to April, which was $899,315. The average sale price for an apartment style condo in May was $457,935. This represents actually a 3.1% increase compared to April 2021. The average price for a townhouse was $601,987. This represents a decrease of 1.8% compared to April. And the average sale price for a semi was $659,975. This is an increase of 1.2% compared to April. In May, Kitchener-Waterloo and surrounding areas saw 1,061 new listings added to the MLS system. This represents a 3.4% decrease compared to April of this year. The total amount of homes available for sale in the active status at the end of April was 448. This represents a 2.1% decrease compared to April of this year. In May, the number of months of inventory was 0.7. This remains unchanged from April and months of inventory has been less than one since October. The number of months of inventory represents how long it would take to sell off the current inventories at the current rate of sales. Finally, the average number of days it took to sell a home in May was nine. This also remains unchanged since April. So my hot take on all of this is it looks like the market is beginning to stabilize. What I'm seeing on the ground personally on our team and in the business is some listings are going still crazy over asking multiple offers, 10, 20 offers at a time. And some are actually holding offers for an offer review date and they're not getting the number that they were expecting to get. So there's a bit of a disconnect between seller's expectation and what the market's replying with. That's leaving some sellers unfortunately disappointed um, either blaming the market or blaming their realtor, but this is a reality. And this, this is not the first time this has happened. We've had a very aggressive market at the beginning of this year. And this is, unfortunately, realities and perceptions are gonna change. So as things progress, I think this is a better position for the buyers. Uh, buyers, now's your opportunity to jump in. You can secure a, a property without going as crazy over asking. Now, again, there's caveats to all this. Some homes are getting no offers, other homes are still getting a crazy amount of offers and, and they're highly desirable, whether they have a nice lot or great finishes. Um, so those are always gonna be desirable. But for buyers now, there's a little bit more opportunity for you to get out there and be prudent and aggressive in securing your home. 
thanks for tuning in guys. If you're looking to buy or sell in Waterloo region, please reach out to me. I'd love to take care of you. Alternatively, if you're looking to make a move somewhere else in Ontario, reach out to me too. I've got a network of agents that are ready to work for you. If you learned something today, make sure you like this video and let me know what you think. Leave a comment below and I'll be sure to reply. For the Kostecki Real Estate Group, I'm Peter Kostecki. Thanks for tuning in and we'll talk to you soon.